Hey guys, how are you doing? Good morning. Margarita here. If you are new here, welcome on board. Today's video is about my morning routine, what I do from the moment I wake up as a mom of three up to about 10 o'clock. So welcome to my productive morning routine. I wake up by 5.30 on weekdays, use at least 20 minutes to command my morning by reading the word of God and do my morning prayers. Yes, this is always a best way for me to start the day by asking God for guidance, wisdom, provision, protection throughout the day. Once I'm done with players, I will brush my teeth, clean my hands and proceed to the kitchen. It's 10 minutes to 6 and I want to prepare Rain's porridge. Rain's is a poor feeder and so we always prefer him taking porridge in the morning and especially because they are not allowed to carry anything at school uh, except water. So I always make sure we have a uh, porridge fry in the house and although sometimes on weekends he doesn't take porridge but this really really help him.
for the main breakfast we will be taking these boiled sweet potatoes and arrowroots i will also uh, make uh, some smokies and of course our kenyan tea As this cooks, I'll go wake my son up. We always wake Thanks. him up 20 minutes to 7. That is exactly 6.40 a.m. He Come. leaves I'm to school uh, at 7.50 a.m. in the morning. So he has almost one hour to take breakfast, blush uh, his teeth, visit bathroom and stuff like that. This way he doesn't feel lashed. This place is very, very cold, and those who have visited Nanyuki can tell you Nanyuki can get really, really cold, and especially early in the mornings and late in the evenings. So when he wakes up, I always make sure that he he is on warm clothes. <music> It's allowed 7 in the morning and my daughters are waking up. This is Brenda. She is going to class by 8 a.m. So she has waken up. She is a human resource management uh, student. To make work easier for me this morning, I always prepare rain clothes and shoes before I go to bed. That is last night. I iron them and hang them well and also polish, polish his shoes. This has been my routine since my firstborn daughter joined or started schooling. And it has really, really uh, worked for me. So what I'm doing here, I'm just making sure that the shoe shines a little, little well. I will be sharing this in my evening routine which will come later after I post this. So stay tuned, guys. Don't want to miss that. Happy is back in the house. He woke up before me today. He was checking on things to do with our business. On a normal day, I always wake up before everyone else. But for him, he wakes up early when he's going uh, out of town for business or when duty calls. Rains is done with breakfast, so it's time to blush his teeth. He doesn't need much guidance when blushing his teeth. He needs just minimal supervision, like to pick the cup and also uh, to put the toothpaste. Just that he doesn't need much, so he, he loves blushing his teeth and he does it very, very well. Joanne is awake. It's around 7.30 now. She has an online class. She is doing coding. 
the class uh, is starting by 8 to 10. Sometimes her classes start as early as 6, but the lecturers changed the time, so she'll be doing it from 8 to 10. Rains takes his shower immediately he comes from school, so he doesn't have to shower again this morning. So what I do, I only clean his face and he will be good to go. I know this is strange, isn't it? Oh yes, but Snowball takes his water in this sink. Even if we give him water through his bowls and plates, he never uses that water, he never drinks, but he always come early in the morning and takes water in the tub. So we got used to it. But don't worry, we always clean the sink. So after this, I'll clean the sink very well and it will be good for us to use. It's 15 minutes to 8 and Rains is ready to go to school. He leaves uh, in five minutes time. So we're going to do uh, prayers together and then he will leave to school. It's now 8 a.m. in the morning. We want to take breakfast. It's not always like this. Normally, Mark leaves immediately. He escorts Reigns to catch a school bus. And he also leaves with Brenda and drops her to school. So we are privileged to take breakfast together today. <laughs> yes, shooting takes time. Hence, Habi decided to come back and take breakfast with us. Brenda says she's leaving around 9 today and Jojo's class starts by 8.30. So most of the times, our mornings are very, very busy with each having their own routines and following their own schedules. We don't have a house manager in this house. The last one we had was a debug two years ago. We don't need one since now I am a full-time mom and my babies are all grown up. We help each other with house chores, yes, but normally in most mornings I do most of the work. In K 
case you're wondering why we are not opening the cuttings it's because it's a bit very very shitty and i feel like when you are not opening them we are we retain some warmth in the house so we are going to open them in an hour's time it's time now for brenda to go and prepare herself for joanne she doesn't need much preparations online classes uh doesn't need much preparation so she'll just pick her laptop her notebooks and she'll be good to go Once Brenda is gone, I will proceed to bedrooms and make our beds. I will start with Lorraine's bed. For the girls, they are big girls now. They make their own beds and they also uh, open the cuttings. So I don't have to struggle cribing their decker to open the cuttings. And for Reigns, he doesn't make his own bed uh, like light now even on weekends he tries to but he has to be supervised even on weekends so he's still at an early age but with time he will learn to do it For the black marks you see on the wall, we had some stickers all over and <laughs> Rains removed all of them. That's why you are seeing all those black marks. So now I will proceed to my bedroom and I will start by opening the curtains. I love, love these curtains. They were in my living room and I brought them here in my bedroom and they are doing very, very well. They are uh, right blocking and they serve us very, very well in this bedroom. For our bed, I'm not changing the beddings today. Yes, because it's on a weekday. We do this. We do change our beddings on weekends. So I will spread the bed and proceed to go and shower. Then do my simple skincare routine.
So once I'm done showering, I'll proceed to use this Garnier Pure Active Charcoal. Today I'm using a mask. So you can scrub or decide to use it as a mask and it's very very good for removing blackheads. After generously applying all over my face, I'll give it five minutes to be absorbed. And while I'm waiting, I'll, I'll hydrate since in the morning I didn't take some water. So I'll take advantage of this time and hydrate. This motivational water bottle is very, very good. And especially for those people who, who don't take water regularly, this has some motivational quotes that really motivates you to take more water. After I'm done washing my face, I'll tap dry with a clean towel and start my skincare routine. Today, I am not doing much since I am not applying makeup. So I will start with a toner, which is loose water. Then I will apply my vitamin C face serum. I'm using this one for Dr. Lachelle. Then I will apply my sunscreen. I'm using the Nivea sunscreen and I love, love this Nivea sunscreen. Then I will apply lip gloss and I'm good to go. Today I'm not going to do makeup. I'm still indoors so I'm not going to apply any makeup today. Once I'm done with my face, I will proceed to my bedroom and apply my body lotion. And that will be my simple skincare routine for the days that I'm staying at home. So from there, I'll dress up and I'll head to the kitchen. <music> So here I will start by clearing everything that is on top of this cooker and yes so I will start with keeping and stalling uh, all the breakfast leftovers. I can see we also have uh, our last night uh, dinner leftover so I will store all of them. Yes so with this for lunch and for 4 o'clock 
snacks we are sorted this is also what my sons take when he comes back from school by four o'clock so let me like clear the whole of this cooker and then i clean it after that i'll go and start cleaning the dishes Once I'm done, I will go ahead and remove the dried up dishes from the utensil lock so that I can create space for more. From here, I will proceed to the sink and clear all this load and, and clear all this load of dishes and leave this place a clean and organized place.
will surely get burned if you reach out and touch my mind is a battle i'm trying to hide it getting these voices inside to stay quiet under the Once I'm done with the dishes, I usually mop the floor. So for today, I'm mopping kitchen and our uh, walkway only for the living room and for the bathroom. I cleaned them yesterday. So what I will do, I will just dust uh, just a little bit. And yes, so let's do the mopping. We start with the, our walkway and also clean our sink area. Once I'm done cleaning, I will relax and catch up with my favorite YouTube channels as I edit my vlog. Of course, this vlog, I usually take a nap between 1 to 2 p.m. Then by 4 p.m., I will pick up lanes from school and then uh, evening routine starts. So that's uh, our simple yet productive morning routine. I hope you'll have learned one or two things from us. See you in my next. Bye. Oh.